Yeah, hi there from Seattle's Central District, where an important piece of the community's history is not only being preserved, but it is being renewed. The fire station behind me built in 1908. It is historic, but arguably served a bigger purpose for a long time. And now the Community Food Bank and Resource Center is back. Homecoming is definitely the word, right? We're returning home after, I would say, a little over a year and a half at our temporary location in Capitol Hill and uh, coming home to a completely new setup. We've got this whole space renovated. Okay, so you're not 11. Because we're a nationally and locally registered historical landmark, we didn't mess with the outside that much at all, really. So you can still tell that it's got that, that old spirit to it. We have the original timber from the Elliott Bay Mill, which has uh, been closed for over 100 years, you know what I mean? And that's still exposed wood right upstairs in the part of the building. What can you tell me about the namesake she celebrated on the wall? Yeah, Miss uh, Roberta Bird Barr, definitely a Seattle staple. She's uh, an educator, organizer, journalist, activist. So it's very important to us to be able to memorialize and honor our black Seattle people that have led the way for us, you know. Oh, I'm a volunteer. Uh, I've been with Bird Bar for a year and a half now. You know, there's a delivery this morning, I think oftentimes from a farmer's market or a local co-op that brings in the freshest produce that is, it's incredible. It's uh, really high quality, really lush colors. The it's vibrant. Mm -hmm. It's really, really a treat to be able to offer. So the food bank uh, titled the market now. You know, we have the canned goods, we got some tuna, some chicken and whatnot, but then we have fresh salmon that we got in today. They have options available to them, right? We're really coming from a mindset of abundance. The ultimate vision is to secure a more equitable uh, future for all Washingtonians, and we have many programs that help do that, so it's not only our market. We're always looking to stock the volunteer roster, absolutely.